We are in Comiso, one of the capitals of Sicilian Baroque style, the architectural style that in Sicily has found a unique and ingenious location, so much so that it has become a world heritage site, according to UNESCO. The white stone of Comiso, which makes this part of Sicily a sort of outpost of the African continent, enriched by cactus, sea and sun, keeps us company in this romantic part of Comiso. We are welcomed by Gianni Inzacco, scientific director of the Natural History Museum, a sort of child to him who has given birth, grown and become a stronghold of the Sicilian cultural scene. Benvenuti nel Museo di Storia Naturale di Comiso, che è una istituzione scientifica Welcome to the Museum of Natural History of Comiso. The museum is divided into a paleontological section and a zoological one. The museum heritage is represented by over 14 collections and over 27,000 artifacts. This museum is a unique place, absolutely amazing. Sicily of the temples, the amphitheaters, the Baroque style, the Arab Norman art, the 5,000 tombs of Pantalica, the Phoenician settlements, the Byzantine rock caves, surprisingly, also gives us this wonderful museum, another Sicilian masterpiece, like many other museums on the island an infinite cultural heritage for this island desired, loved and often conquered by people from all over the Mediterranean. The director guides us through 500 million years old animals from various continents, one of the richest collections in the world. From the first organisms to the armored fish of the Paleozoic, from the ammonites to the great reptiles that colonized the world during the Mesozoic, up to the mammals of the Quaternary, men included. Those are salamander footprints from 280 million years ago. I fossili, alcuni dei fossili più antichi della Sicilia mm. e in particolare quelli provenienti dalla pietra di Salomone. These are the fossils found in Salomon's stone uh, 260 million years ago. Mamma mia, if these fossils came to life, there will be a big fear in here. Okay. E poi abbiamo dalla Sicilia queste bellissime ammoniti. These are beautiful Sicilian ammonites that also 180 million years ago were in the Mediterranean seabed and then were brought by tectonic movements to the surface. Check out a flying reptile. This is a dinosaur from Mongolia. Fish and shark teeth to no end. This was a Pliocene penguin from Peru. This rocky ragusa was processed to make uh, sidewalks, where portions of 18 million year old cetaceans have been found. So be careful when you walk in Sicily. You will always be walking through history, whether it be in the form of a Greek coin, an Arab necklace, a Phoenician dagger, or fossils of all kinds. Here is a famous dwarf elephant of 600,000 years ago. This was a little more than a meter high, and Sicily was full of them. Up here, the little elephant is with the giant swan, the giant dormouse, the giant turtle. And these are the eggs of the giant turtle. In Sicily, in more recent times, there were other elephants, always dwarfed but larger than the first, and they shared the territory with bears, deers, 
hippos, wolves and hyenas. A real forest. This is us. E stiamo cercando di realizzare a breve anche una tartuga gigante. This is a Sicilian giant turtle. Little fish and crab. Let's hope we never meet underwater. Snakes, uh, crocodiles, iguanas, sharks, whales, fish. What a wonder this place. This is uh, considered a very important uh, living fossil, the silacanth, found in Madagascar, believed uh, to be extinct but still swimming in the waters of the earth. These are the fishes that uh, live in the abysses where there is no light. In the Strait of Messina there are many that emerge every now and then. They are really monstrous and fascinating. This is a beautiful giant squid. Quite unbelievable this museum never ends. Here we leave the sea and say goodbye to that beautiful giant sunfish, the Mola Mola, which weighs 900 kilos. Now there are now there are ostriches, giant eggs, penguins, the mythical dodo, unfortunately extinct in 1600 because it was excessively hunted by the bad men. It was really a wonderful experience visiting this Sicilian museum. We stayed in a beautiful place and met another extraordinary Sicilian. Gianni Inzacco, the father of all these bizarre and fascinating creatures.